welcome back to my channel guys it's your girl ruthie and i'm back with another video this time i'm going to be doing a wig review thank you to love me for sponsoring this video because your girl has had her hair out for about four months it was time for protective style so um in today's video i'll be talking about a seven by six closure hd lace wig the remaining contents of the box was a wig bag a rewards card an edge brush a wig grip wig caps that are actually our skin tone color because i was sick and tired of that beige color so i was very excited to see this a user's manual in case you know you have any questions i was just there pretending to read it knowing that i wasn't going to read it but anyway let's get into this wig so the wig is the parting max glueless wig in loose body wave it's a seven by six closure hd lace here i'm showing you guys how seamlessly the lace matches with my skin tone the wig has maximum versatility that i'll be showing you guys very shortly it's beginner friendly it comes pre-plucked pre-bleached you really don't have to do too much to mess with it you just gotta plop it on your head and for the most part you're good to go So my first impressions of this wig when I put it on was, again, looking at that HD lace and how seamlessly it does melt into my skin. I was looking forward to using some melting spray as well, um, cutting the lace just to, just to see the full picture. Again, it is a closure wig, so it's not from ear to ear. It's not a frontal, which I prefer. Um, I've always been, been more of a closure girl than a lace front girl because I don't, I'm not really into the whole gluing something across my entire headline. So if you're someone that wants something easier to manage, easier to put on, easier to apply, I would go for a closure wig. And the nice thing about this type of closure wig, again, it is a, it's not a four by four, which is what you normally see, which has a like smaller area for parting. This one is a seven by six. So you have plenty of parting options. y'all can see here the first parting style i went with was what was already in the wig this is how the wig came with a c part a nice little side part a cheeky little side part um i didn't have to recurl the hair just yet i'm sure um a few touch-ups would be nice though all i had to do was apply the wax and hot comb the edges or hot comb the part just to make sure that it lays flat this is optional, but just to make sure that, you know, as I'm out and about, the, the wig isn't going to move. I do, I did go in with some melting spray. Again, it's optional, you don't really have to, but I just like to have that security, <laughs> you know? Another parting option that you can go for is a middle part. Everybody loves a classic middle part. So again, going in with some wax and then a hot comb to flatten it out. I did have to go back in and touch up the curls a little bit to have some, some more volume because while it was in transit in the box, some of the curls flattened out. So I just touched up a few in the front as they frame my face.
please look at the way that lace is just melted against my skin you cannot tell me that this isn't growing out of my scalp i really love the way this lace melted beautiful chef's kiss mwah, mwah. Okay, so I wanted to try some a little bit out of the box, you know, so I did a little zigzag part or whatever. And now I'm adding in some French braids. I realized that, dang, it's actually a little, <laughs> it's difficult doing cornrows on like very silky smooth hair. Because I'm just so used to doing it on coarse, thick, natural hair. But anyway, here you have me doing two braids across the front um and then pulling it into a ponytail again this kind of highlights how you can part the hair in different ways and then you can also see the sides of my hair the edges still have some integrity <laughs> you can still believe that hmm is it hers i don't know um so i love that Ultimately, I decided to go for a side part. I'm a side part girly. I'm a side part or middle girly. I flip flop in between. Which one are you? Comment below. Side part or middle part. But I really like this like modest side part. It's not too deep. It's just a little, a little modest side part. And it, I just really love this style. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know what you think below. Would you try a wig like this? Would you try a 7x6 closure wig? Honestly, very simple and easy to style. All right, thanks for watching. I will see you guys in my next video. Deuces.